Hey guys, it's uh, me and in this video I'll show you how to upgrade your Windows uh, 7 or Windows 8 or Windows 8.1 uh, Parallels virtual machine to Windows 10 as Microsoft has released uh, uh, the Windows 10 uh, So um, it's not a big complicated process really. I mean, I'm talking about the upgradation process uh, You need to run your Windows 7 machine or Windows 8 or 8.1 machine and uh, open Internet Explorer um let's see um yeah there was the link actually that's the link you need to visit uh, you, you only need to visit this link i'm going to um you know the actually this link is going to be given into the description uh, below you can copy it from there um you need to paste it in uh, microsoft internet explorer and uh, uh scroll down um, see even if uh, even there are some instructions over here before you begin um, if you want to create a USB media then you know these instructions are for you even if you want to create a DVD um, here uh, these these instructions are given so uh, we'll just roll down you know we're going to upgrade uh, Windows uh, our Windows machine I'm talking about the parallels uh, virtual machine uh, so um, if you have a 32-bit operating system, um, you know, I just need to click uh, this button or for the 64-bit version um, You need to visit this link actually. It's uh, going to start a, a, a download uh, So click on it uh, download a program. Um, let's click on it. I already have downloaded But just in case uh, you wanted to know see uh, this is the name of it media creation tool I already have so I'll pause it or cancel it and I'll just go directly to my downloads directory and there I have yeah media creation tool so um, run it once it's downloaded yes there you have um, yeah Windows 10 setup what do you want to do if you want to create uh, installation media for another PC you can also do that as well but uh, what we are going to do it's actually we are upgrading our, our virtual machine so we're going to select the first option upgrade this PC now and uh, press next um, I already have upgraded uh, my windows as you can see uh, yes there it is the start menu again that's beautiful anyways uh, so um, the process actually is when you uh, press the next button is going to download uh, the Windows 10 ISO uh, and it's going to take uh, a lot of time because I think it's about 3 GB I mean roughly 3 GB uh, so it's going to take time and it's going to start you know the upgradation process you don't need to do anything else really I mean that's it so go ahead and uh, download it upgrade your Windows um, that's it guys thanks